how to get BL Heli 32 working on your Linux machine. As you can see, I run Linux. I've run Linux for a long time. And I have an education in many operating systems. Linux, and including Windows, AIX Unix, Sun Solaris, Novell Netware. Not that anyone really uses Novell Netware anymore. Didn't they come out with Novell Linux? Hmm. Well, out of all of my education in operating systems, I feel that Linux is the superior operating system. And if you're like me and you're into FPV and mini quads and freestyle racing with mini quads and etc., then you might find yourself in a sticky situation with BL Heli 32. You see, BL Heli 32 only has a suite of programs to connect to it that are designed to work on Windows. Um, so if you're like me and use Linux, that could be a problem. Now, a lot of people have tried to set up Wine and use BL Heli 32 and found that it doesn't connect to the quadcopter. And there's an easy way to solve that problem. I'm going to show you how. So the first thing you need to do is download the BL Heli suite for Windows. And I have it here where I'm ziggling around on my desktop in this folder ready to go. The next thing we need are the commands. And to make it easy, I have a little cheat sheet, which I'm going to put right, yeah, right there is fine, right above me with all the commands that we're going to do to make this work. I'm going to also post these down in the description so that you can copy and paste to make life so much easier if you like. And then the last thing we're going to need is a terminal. And yes, one of my favorite all-time favorite movies is War Games, if you couldn't tell. And if you don't know what that movie is and you haven't seen it, it's an awesome 80s movie. Check it out. Um, but let's just smash this over here. The first command that we're going to run is this one, which is uh, a command that's basically going to add your user into the dial-out group. Because in order to use the port, to connect, you need to have privileged rights, which means that you would have to run blheli32 as root or with a sudo command, or we could just add our user into the dialout group, which you've probably already done if you're using like Betaflight or anything else that's gonna use a USB connection. So we're gonna go ahead and paste that in here. We're gonna put in our password and we shouldn't have to put our password again for the next commands. So now our users added into the dial out group. So the next command that we're going to do is basically going to create a symbolic link or a thin link inside the directory inside wine where the um, the well DOS devices like your COM ports and things are um, and it's going to in the name of that is going to be the name that Linux uses for its ports you see Windows and Linux use different methods to kind of define their ports so that's why they don't mesh and that's why you can't connect when you just run BL Heli 32 with wine um, incidentally you have to install wine as well I'm not going to get into that. It's as simple as sudo apt install wine. Um, I'm assuming that you've already done that. So now let's go ahead and paste this command in. So the first one we're going to make com1, which is the Windows name for it. Uh, we're going to make a link to it for the device TTY USB 0, USB 1, and uh, ACM 0. So you punch that one in, done. Um, so then we're going to copy the next command. And by the way, this is this is pretty darn easy. It doesn't get much more easy than this. Enter, and then we're gonna put the last one in. So now we have our sim links in, and you might get BL Heli 32 to work correctly now, but you really should register the components inside the wine machine in its registry. So in order to do that, I have this little bit of registry key. And in order to get that to work, we need to put it inside of a file. So we're going to highlight that. And uh, I'm, 
I'm old school, so none of this nano bullshit. I'm gonna use VIM. So um, VI, okay, and then name your file. Uh, we're just gonna name it key.reg. All right, and we're gonna go in it and we're gonna hit I to insert. We're gonna paste, we're gonna escape out of I, and then we're gonna write and quit. All right, and then the next thing you need to do, pretty much an easy one, reg edit, and then you're going to key.reg, and then you hit enter, and you're done. All you need to do is run reg edit, and then the file name, you put that in there. And now, it should work. So why don't I go ahead and get a quadcopter that's got BL Heli and we'll try it out. Oh, and I got the battery, it's all connected, and I'm going to hook it up. Ah. Mm -hmm. And, ooh. Well, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Let's go into our folder here. Let's run BL Heli 32, and let's close out of this. So if you've installed Wine and you've tried to run it, you've get this far. But let's see what happens now after we've run all those commands. Boom! Connection! It works. So we got all our ESCs. Let's check it. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, man. BL Heli working on Linux. Very easy. Um, I hope this helps you out from here. You can go ahead and do whatever you need to do on your BL Heli 32 ESCs, and you don't have to touch that icky sticky windows. Like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, and be sure to catch me next time I put up another video. In the meantime, thanks for watching.